How's it going? We're back. Cause this girl isn't gonna quit till she hits a hundred. <laughs> My name's Kelsey, I'm single, and today I am going to be playing once more the 100 Baby Challenge. It's a challenge in The Sims where you make one matriarch and she is supposed to have 100 babies with 100 different dads. There's a lot of rules, so if you're interested in those, they will be linked below. We made a lot of money, so I had a home renovation. The house looks different, is the point I'm trying to make. Oh, we need to find a new man to romance. Ooh. Let's do it. Episode nine, yeehaw. That's not gonna be my new catchphrase. Welcome back to the Baby Factory fam. This is what our home looks like now. It looks really good. Dang, I forgot how good my house looks. Let's jump into their lives and see what's up. We've got Chelsea. Our girl is preggers as heck, heck and pregs. Looks like she's in her third trimester, so who knows when she'll pop. I don't think we have a new suitor yet in, in the works. But we might wanna take Chelsea out on the town to meet a new a new bay. Miles is over here with his new crop top looking fierce and fine. Uh, and uh, why don't you repair that, my friend? Oh, who's crying? Why are you crying? Hazel, she's just really sad because she's really hungry. Oh no, okay. Pause everything. Hazel's upset and hungry. Do we have any food in our, we do. We have a garden salad. We've got a garden salad always in the fridge. You can grab one of those, my little girl. Next, we got Charlie, our sweet baby, our angel. He looks a little bit mad, but that's fine. She could have a serving. They're all hungry. When did you last eat and why haven't you eaten yet? Chelsea's good to go. She's got her little headboard. Oh my, it's so thundery outside. It's freaking me out. I kind of enjoy it though. So thundery. He's standing up to be! That is so funny to me. Hazel, what are you doing? Stop talking to everybody and fix your needs so you're not dying. Honey, I know you like being cool and social, but you gotta, gotta eat, girl. Oh, look at the kids over here in the family room. I'm loving this new decor. We even have painting. That's how baller we are. You know you've made it when you spent money on pointless objects that just make the room look a little nicer. You look like you're really good to go, so let's have you do your homework. And she needs to get a skill to level three and do her homework. What skills does she have? No skills. Oh, oh, the computer's not in there anymore. Wow, we've redone our stuff. She's gonna borrow her mom's computer and play some video games. We'll have her be a little gamer girl so she can have fun and build skills at once. Are you killing your Sims? Oh, she's having a woohoo in a tub. I remember the hot tub. Maybe we should get a hot tub. We need to diversify Chelsea's options here. Oh, someone passed out. Oh, it's our girl. Oh no, I'm sorry. Oh no, something else broke. Not the sink, everything's spouting water in my home. We need to get unbreakable objects, but we don't have that much money right now. Once we get more money, we'll start getting unbreakable objects so that this doesn't keep happening. <laughs> it's raining outside and inside the Impeachment house. Oh, they just became good friends by sitting next to each other and doing homework. Bonding twins. Homework complete, good job, Miles. I don't know if I appreciate the cargo pant moment, but but I do appreciate a crop top moment. Now get in there and repair my boy. Chelsea's gonna walk in and pee while her son's in there. He didn't get to finish. Chelsea, since when were you shy? We'll have him repair this over here then first, and then we'll have him repair this. Chelsea's playing games? No, no. If you're gonna be doing something, you should be writing. Good boy, Miles, repair work. Look at it, he repaired it. I'm so proud of you, baby. Someone not finished their garden salad? <gasps> Shook. She should take a bladder break after you're done with your stuff. Charlie's burning the midnight oil on his homework like a good boy. Yes, responsible bean. Oh, is, is Miles singing in the shower like a champion? He is. And Chelsea's just giggling to herself in her room. <laughs> She's gonna go watch her mom. Aww. Oh, Chelsea finished her book. Chelsea's going to sell the publisher. It's her fun book. And then she's gonna take a bathroom moment, ignoring her child as usual who came over to hang out with her. Look at her being so messy in her cute little outfit. I love it. Chelsea's like back to bed dreaming of babies and boys. We'll have Hazel sleep. Good night, Hazel. Good night, Impeachishme family. Look at her crawling in. She's like, okay, I guess I'm going to bed now. Good night. Yay, it's New Year's Eve. Charlie's up. He's gonna 
grab a salad. Oh, he was going to already. He doesn't need me. You don't need your mom, Charlie. You're gonna be your own independent boy, making good choices. Renee's getting herself a piece of cake. Renee! Kids are slowly waking up at 8, 8 a.m. They're taking care of themselves because they are independent. Ooh, he's wearing glasses too. He hurt himself. Yes, Miles. Aw, uh, Olive called Renee to say congratulations. I like how the teens are just in their mom's room. Like, whatever, we're just gonna talk and hang out. Oh, speaking of teens, teens can get jobs. Hey, 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 hey. Yes. Get a job, teens. Yeah, we're gonna have them do manual labor as usual. Oh, we got some more royalties. $1,700 of royalties. It looks like right now the screen plays are the best performing. So she'll just be a romance movie screenwriter. Why are you so sad? Time to wear black. She's just having a mood swing. Sad because I'm sad. You wouldn't understand. Nobody would understand. I understand. She's almost done sleeping, I think. Let me see what her, yeah. Oh, gone into labor, Chelsea's in labor! Hold the phone, Chelsea's in labor. Have baby at the hospital. Yeah, we're gonna join her. Karen's here, he's freaking out. He's like, baby, I wasn't, I don't know if I signed up for this. And he's like, oh no, I'm not looking forward to this. Don't say goodbye, what, is he leaving? He left. They all leave. Back in her classic outfit <laughs> here, ready to go have a kid. Or two, or three, who knows? I hope we get twins. Triplets would be crazy, but I don't know if that's possible. I don't know what will happen. Wait, is it doing it itself? She doesn't even have a doctor in this room. <laughs> The doctor came in after. She's like, I've been here enough times to know exactly what I need to do. I can start this machine myself. Is she like really good friends with this doctor now? She kind of is. That's hilarious. Ah, oh, Chelsea just gave birth to a baby boy. Time to pick a commenter to name the babies. Now, if you're wondering how to get a hold of me to give your baby names, it is not through Instagram. It is not on my personal Twitter. Don't try to tell me during my live streams. I'm not gonna remember. The real place you need to go is just to comment below on this very video, your baby names, and that's where I look. Wow. Some of these names are my ex's names and I can't. <laughs> so I'm like, no, I'm not naming my son my ex's name. All right, so this person said Eric for a baby name. I like the name Eric. It reminds me of a Disney prince, 10 out of 10. Name is Eric. Eric and Peachishme, welcome to the Impeachishme family. That's it? We only had one baby? All right, we've only hit nine. I refuse, wait, why does she still look pregnant? That's okay. Chelsea, we love you no matter what you look like. You're always Chelsea in our hearts. Oh, nope, she changed clothes and her stomach immediately disappeared. I'm really disappointed that it was only one baby instead of twins, but that's okay. We just need to find a baby daddy and get some twins going for the next round. All right, you know what? Let's take Chelsea out on the town. She hasn't been out in a while. Let's go out with Brielle. Brielle and her are going out on the town. Let's go to the museum. That's kind of fun. Oh my God, they match! Chelsea, give Brielle a hug. Be like, hey. Oh, you usually have toast. Let's toast to the new year. Oh, who's that? Hey, what's up? Hey, 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 wait, 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 who are you? Who are you? Felix Jacobs. Go run after Felix Jacobs, Kelsey. Chelsea. He kind of looks a little young, but he's an adult and Chelsea's just a young adult. Let's look around, see who's here. Those people are here. It doesn't really look like too many of the dads are around that you guys made us. Hello, daddies. Dads. There's ice skating. This middle woman's so mad. I'm gonna go skating. I'm gonna have a great time and meet my next man. I just had a baby. I'm ready to go. Oh, there she just jumped into her shoes. Oh, she's bad at this. I love it. It's so cute. Oh, no. She's not very coordinated. I'm not very coordinated, but I'm pretty okay at skating. She looks really awkward. I don't know if this is gonna be the moment you're gonna meet the man of your dreams, really, at the skating run around in a circle alone, falling on your butt. Let's check back here, see if anyone's shown up. A lot of women are at the museum today. So we reached fitness level two with Chelsea. 
Good job, Chelsea. Wow, really? We're not seeing any guys? You know, it was early day and who is this? Yeah, that's Sergio. We already had a baby with him. Oh man. Wow, it's slim pickings out here. We're gonna go straight to the source. We're gonna go right to their homes. Okay, we're gonna go to the 100 baby challenge house. Hopefully some people will be there. It's not even a house, it's just a lot with a bunch of people on it. But hopefully some of them will be there. We can meet a bunch of people and then we go home. One stop shop, all right. Uh, get to know. Funny introduction, yes, funny introduction to that girl. This guy's cute, flirty introduction. Chelsea's here, she's meeting all the people. She's really making eyes at our girl here, Maria. She can impregnate Chelsea. Chelsea's having a time. She's meeting everyone. Who's that? Damien Thomas, sure, we'll meet you. You look very weird and sad. Oh wow, they're all having a party here on this empty lot. It's weird and awkward and I love it. Who are you? Why are you walking away? Craig from Dream Daddy? It's a new Craig? Well, <laughs> whoa, they're all celebrating New Year's at this impromptu oh God, New Year party in the road. She seems to be already having a flirty encounter with Kaden and an awkward encounter with literally everyone else. Oh wow, so many people are here. Oh, okay, everything's getting uncomfortable because she's trying to flirt with too many people at once. So I think we're gonna take it home. Make sure that our children are doing okay. We were successful in meeting a lot of new significant others to parent the new crop of kids. He's tense, why are you tense? Oh, he's scared of thunderstorms, that's so cute. Renee, it looks like she's also scared of thunderstorms, which is cute. We'll have her take a shower. Oh. This is a bad thunderstorm. Charlie's also stressed about the thunderstorm. Wow, all the kids like hate thunderstorms. Little girl is sad and scared, uh, probably about the thunderstorm, yeah. Chelsea's feeling inspired. Maybe are you inspired to invite someone over? Should we invite someone over? Let's just do it. Steven's our first person that we see on this list to invite over, so we're gonna invite Steven over to the house. Eric is very hungry, he's gonna be taken away. No, not Eric, where is he? Oh, he's in that room. Okay, hold on, let me move Eric. Oh, Steven's gonna be right over. We gotta fix up Eric's needs here. I'm sorry, Eric. Steven's here. What's up, Steven? Steven with his cool man bun. He looks upset though. He looks like a cool guy, a cool miserable guy. Why are you so sad? Maybe we should have invited Maria over, honestly. Sewell. Sewell, uh. Sewell, he's so bummed. Why are you so sad? Is she flirting with him in front of all of her children? Maybe try to cheer him up. He seems a little sad. It's okay, buddy. It's weird that she has to like cheer this man up. He didn't like it. You know what? You can leave. Why am I still talking to him? We're gonna give him one more chance. Okay, he's pl having a pleasant conversation now. Cause I was like, we're gonna kick him out of the house if he keeps being like this. Okay, he seems a little standoffish. I don't know if he likes us. It's like flirt. A little bit, compliment his appearance. Slurred it up a little bit more. Tell a joke about ducks. Ducks, <laughs> so funny. Talk about your dreams. Be like, I dream to someday have 100 babies. Are you down for that? All our kids are headed off to bed. So Chelsea can uh, get her flirt on. Ooh, she kissed his hand. It's getting flirtier here. The heat is turning up. She's like, you would look great in a pair of sunglasses and your lips are delightful. She's like, wow, your hands are so soft. She's like, thank you, I moisturize. Okay, now we're gonna have our first kiss. Aww, their first kiss. That was pretty cute. Oh no, our baby's crying. Oh shoot. Jamie seems pretty good. He should change the diaper. Mom's busy flirting it up. Oh my gosh. We'll flirt again and then once he's done changing the diaper, we should try for baby. Okay, and then maybe bounce him a little bit and then go to bed. <laughs> he's taking a selfie. He's like, best brother ever. Chill. So so. So so. Mom's flirting with a strange man in the living room. You wanna try for a baby in my closet? Yeah, baby. Well, Chelsea's a little tired and needs to pee and is hungry, but we gotta get this done, you know? We gotta seal this deal. She seems like he he's down for a little bit of a fling. Samba. What? What do you mean goodbye? No, no, you're not leaving yet. Hold his hands. You don't need to pee yet, Chelsea. Stop this man. What do you mean are you leaving? This is not a goodbye. We just asked him to have a baby with us in the closet and he was like, bye. 
I think he was a little nervous. He seems a little shyer. Chelsea's obviously not looking for anything that serious from him, but I think more than the other guys, he seems like a chill, a chill guy. Like a little bit standoffish. All right, but they are breaking down the door. Rare. Well, he, sti he was a little standoffish before, but now he seems like he is totally... He's a closer. That's all I gotta say about that situation. Let's take our pregnancy test just to double check. She's eating for two! Okay, great, everyone's asleep, except for the baby. What is he doing? Is he cleaning our shower? He's cleaning our shower for us. Wow, what a guy, what a man. Oh, it's spring, and he says, okay, I gotta get going, see you later. And work starts in an hour for both of them very soon. I wanna try super effective, efficient baby care. Oh. She gave a bottle, rocked it. There you go, that was super efficient. Renee's off to work, bye Renee! Oh, I'm sorry you're sad when you're going to work, work hard. Miles, bye! Have a good time at work, honey. You wanna take a bath? You oh, look yes. really filthy and you smell. Cute. Oh, she's so sad because she's smelly. We really dropped the ball this weekend, but mom needed to make some new friends. So no harm there. Ugh, what a perfect lad. What, what do you need to do? Nothing, you're perfect. He doesn't need to do anything. He's so perfect. Eric is chilling. Good boy, Eric. Hazel's gonna start on her skill building over here with her little bunny pad. Ooh, Santa just called us. I am not a fan of Santa. He is so creepy. And to those who think that she needs to have a baby with Santa, what is your problem? Ew. No, Karen, I'm busy. We've already moved on to Steven, which Steven felt like a, a brief moment in time. We can't always get emotionally attached to every daddy, because I feel like if we did, that would be very trying for us all. So we're up to baby nine. Oh wait, speaking of which, we'll add this right here. Perfect! Our teens are home. They made us some cash money. <laughs> we got a little crooner on our hands here. Good job, Miles. Oh, baby's upset. Mom, super efficient baby care. Go, super mom mode. Yeah, Olive, you, of course you can come over. Are you okay, Chelsea? Are you not feeling too hot? Look at it, so sweet Olive! She's slowly and creepily walking. What is that? <laughs> they were hugging, but not at all. That was the creepiest hug I think I've ever seen. Everyone's sitting down to a meal together. Oh my God, and two people got up and ruined it. Thanks, Renee. It's almost Eric's birthday. That's nice. Eric will be aged up. Oh, she's giving her younger sister a hug and chatting with her, catching up. This is so nice. They're all sitting down, except for Alexis, who's a little awkward, but it's fine. There she goes. Okay, she's sitting down now. Just as Chelsea gets up. No, Chelsea, don't do that. The one time Chelsea wants to clean up. Why is she so angry? She just needs to go to bed. For being so clingy, she's actually very independent. Like, why are they all in there? Mom's trying to write and they're all like, oh, let's all hang out in mom's new big bedroom. So he's a B student and so is she, but they're average. But it is possible they might age out this episode, which would be sad, but also is necessary to continue this challenge, which is what we're, we're going for. Oh, this family time. The baby in the corner. So we've made some money. So now I think we're gonna sell some of these objects to get better objects that won't keep breaking. I don't see an unbreakable shower. I thought that was a thing. We'll do that. And then with the toilet is this one's unbreakable. This one we're gonna sell. And then we're gonna go for something that won't break as much. Oh, this one's unbreakable. Whew, that's very expensive, but unbreakable, which is good. Amazing. Okay, we pretty much used up all our money, but it, I'm proud of us that we have less breakable objects, I think. Why are you feeling flirty? You feeling flirty, boy? Maybe he should meet someone. Renee's still in that outfit which cracks me up. Chelsea's feeling pretty proud of herself. She's like, I've got a new, a lovely new home. I upgraded all of my bathrooms. She's like whistling in the shower. 
our pregnant queen. She's watching a movie with her kids. So cute. She's feeling awesome. She's got a new baby and she's eating for two and she's watching a fun movie and she took a great shower. She's loving her life right now. And who can blame her? All our kids went to bed, like good kids before school. We're making good money. Maybe someday we'll be in like a big, big house where all the kids can have their own rooms. Could you just imagine? Oh, she's thinking about a family member. She's thinking about Brielle. She's like, I wonder what Brielle's up to these days. I guess she could write another screenplay. What's a good rom-com name? It all started with a swipe. It all started with a swipe. A modern love story. She leveled up her writing skill. Oh, our boy is already taking care of his needs. So is our girl here, Renee. They're having salads for breakfast. Our little Hazel's awake. She's having a little potty time. Ooh, literary digest, let's go. She's so proud of herself. Good job, you made a good job, potty. All is chill in the Peachy Schmay household for now. Bum bum. But why did you change into that, Chelsea? What is it about this hospital gown that makes you think, yeah, I wanna wear that, not in a hospital? Ooh, she's a one-star celebrity? <gasps> Dominic passed away, her first baby daddy. She's like feeling so confident. She's like, I'm kind of famous for my writing and also for being pregnant and casually wearing hospital gowns unnecessarily. Renee's after school, bye Renee, have a good time at school. Bye Miles, have a good time at school. Study hard, everybody. Charlie, our darling. Oh, he's taking a shower. No, Charlie, you should go to school. Wearing his cool jacket. Just rolling in late like, whatever, mom. I'm gonna crush this. He's that kid that gets everything easy, never has to study, gets an A in every class, and it's just like, what? I'm naturally perfect, and you're like, you love him because you can't not love him, but you are so envious and hate him a little bit. Charlie, bye. I think you should probably change. Mom's asleep, baby's chilling. Eric is chilling. All right, Hazel, it's all me and you. It's some bonding time between Hazel and Kelsey. Kooky girl with her little sprinkle dress and her cute little sunnies and this really annoying eye patch. She's going in her, her diaper because she can. Mail's been delivered. I bet we have bills. Oh, our bills got so much more expensive once our apartment got more expensive. <laughs> Luckily we can afford them, so that's fine. Wow, I feel like Chelsea might need like a moment to process the news that our first baby daddy has passed on. Like, I think that's really crazy. It doesn't seem like she's processed it. Renee has returned home from school with a school project and is still a B student. Charlie's a B student and Miles is also a B student. They all need a little bit of fun. So they're, all the kids are gonna watch a movie. They're gonna have a movie time after school together. Oh, she's sad. Why are you sad? From losing a friend, she's in mourning. Oh, why don't you cry it out, Chelsea? She really is processing. Maybe that's why she's in this weird outfit. Look at them. What are they doing? It's Eric's birthday! Okay, let's have a, after Chelsea's finished eating, let's have her age him up. Oh, what? Why does, why, why, why is, why is Chelsea have emotion quirk? Emotion bomb. Chelsea's finding it difficult to process her negative emotions in a healthy manner. Feeling of anger or sadness quickly become overwhelming and always result in overdramatic emotional meltdown? What? What do you, what do you mean? Wow. Wow, wow, what? She got a bad fame quirk immediately. Chelsea, you know, I think it's time for you to get a makeover, honestly. Why, why don't you have you cry in your closet a little bit and then we'll give you a makeover. Aw, Mingyu wants us to light some fireworks with him, but we're busy, ah! we're busy and glitchy apparently. Aww. I don't know why she's in a closet crying, but you know, what is she crying over? Cause she's just having a mood swing. I'm sorry, Chelsea. She's like, I feel better now. And her kids are like, yeah, we decided to hang out in your bedroom while you cried in the closet to give you no privacy. All right, but we're here with Chelsea and we're gonna give her a nice little fresh up. I'm not seeing anything I like better for Chelsea than what we had originally. This is just so iconic. We could change the color. Okay, I like changing the color of it. I'm just gonna change the colors of her outfit. Okay, well we just changed the color of a couple of her outfits because I got lazy. Gonna change it up into her new colored overall. She's really sad. My poor darling. You know what I, I bet would cheer you up, Chelsea? Not only is your new wardrobe, which is very cute, 
But also, add to your Instagram story because I am kind of addicted to you being famous. And ask to hang out at Curtin Lunt, let's ask, who is one of our new friends here? Maria. Let's ask Maria to come over and get to know her. She's like, hi, I was just thinking about you and I'd love to hang out. And Maria's like, yeah, I'd love that too. And she's like, nailed it. Oh, Maria's here. What's up, Maria? How oh my gosh, she's so curvy. Maria's already like talking with her kids. Such a cool girl. Maybe Maria should give Chelsea a makeover, honestly. Maria's got a cool style. She's so chill. I love her. She's gorgeous too. Like she's so pretty. Oh my gosh. Chelsea, get to know her. Take it slow with Maria. I feel like Maria's awesome. Ooh, Maria's materialistic. Well, maybe not awesome, but she's cool. She's gonna be a great baby mom. Is she crying in her bed? What's your deal? Oh wait, it's Charlie's birthday today. Chelsea, age up your baby. Let's age up Charlie, or not Charlie. Eric, I have too many kids now. Oh my God, Eric looked like he had two heads for a second. This is. Aw, oh, Jamie sent Eric a gift. Thanks, Jamie. Pick a number between one and eight. The answer is four. Okay, so he's a charmer. Aw, our little Eric is a charmer. <gasps> Look at our handsome lad. Look at his first steps. Come to mama. Oh, he almost fell. Oh, he's cute. And then we'll add a second bed into here. I'm pretty sure we saved some in the inventory. Here we go. He doesn't have any skills. He's brand new. Oh my gosh, Miles is playing with the new baby Eric. This is so cute. Oh. What are you, what is happening here? Meanwhile, Chelsea's getting to know Maria a little bit better. She's complimenting her outfit. Little baby Eric. So you're a charmer. He'll be like the little Prince Charming baby. The twins are sitting next to each other, both studying hard so they can go live with their siblings in that tiny one bedroom apartment, which I put them all in. No, 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 Chelsea, why would you go to bed in there? Talk with her. Let's give a little flirt and see what happens. We're taking it slow with Maria because I feel like Chelsea actually kind of has a pretty big crush on her. Oh! She was into it. She's feeling pretty flirty. No, Charlie, get out. No, don't play, no, Charlie. Don't, stop playing in the closet. Mom is trying to flirt it up. Charlie, whatever, mom left. She was like, oh my gosh, my kid is a lot. Aw, mom and Miles are having a time here. Charlie's still playing in the, in the closet next to Maria. Maria's like, all right, your kids are weird. I'm gonna head out. And I'm like, fair enough. Eric is already getting his skills up, but he's a little tired, so we might send him to bed. Hazel's still asleep. Oh, little, little brother. Eric's sitting next to her. Everyone's asleep. All was well in the Peach Ishmael household. She's in the third trimester already? Oh my gosh, Chelsea. I can't believe Chelsea's already in her third trimester. We might just hit our 10 kids in this episode. And if we do, then we will be able to have our 10 kid vacation celebration. Oh, she just farted. What was that about? That's so funny. Schools for Miles and for Renee and for Charlie starts in about an hour. We shall find out what lays in store for us all. You're good, so why don't you, oh, you can't clean that. What are you good for if you can't clean the counters, Charlie? Besides being perfect. <laughs> oh, he, he can clean that, right? Yeah, go clean the, the kid's potty. Miles is off to school. Ah, oh, Renee! If this is your last day of school, have a great day at school, Renee. You're gonna kill it. I love you, do your best so we can have more babies in the house. Okay, I love you, goodbye. And now we just, it's us and the toddlers. Toddler time. Now she just does thinking and then potty and she's done. Wow, that was very fast. And mom is still sleeping. Who's calling? Is it Maria? Oh, no, it's her children needing problem solved. Let's raise their manners. I didn't even read what that was but it's fine. I think Chelsea maybe should wake up and make a phone call and ask Maria to hang out again. Hey Maria, it's your girl Kelsey, Chelsea. Maria will be right over, that's so good. Okay, and they're chatting too, which is very cute. Mom's like, oh, my children are so good. Where's Maria? Maria, hello. Is Maria not coming over? She said she'd be right over. Where did you go? 
Maria! Did she lie and ditch us? It happened one lunch break. Again? All right, no, no, we're not gonna play it happen one lunch break. It'll be the crush rush. And it's about two NASCAR drivers that fall in love. <laughs> wow, it really doesn't feel like Maria's coming over. Should we call her again? Yeah, it looks like she's not coming over. How weird. She'll be right over. It's so weird. Oh my God, our sweet baby Hazel has reached level three thinking, which means all she needs is potty and then we can age her up and she can be a kid. This outfit's so cute though. She's gonna have to have like the cutest outfits of all time. Maria's here, Maria's over. Hi Maria. Hey, what's up? I like how she just like came in and just sat on Chelsea's bed. It is so cute that they are just so comfortable with each other. Oh, she's getting close. I'm just gonna have her keep going potty. Ooh, they're flirting. Why is it a tedious conversation? Now she's feeling flirty, which is good. Ooh, okay. It's a suggestive conversation now. Maybe confess her attraction and tell an unbelievable story and kiss her hands. Or she should make a move, get to know. Oh my gosh. I'm just really feeling this. Oh, they're having a hug, a nice embrace. <gasps> here we go, here we go, first kiss. <gasps> Yay! Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Oh my gosh, they're so into each other. Just Aww. keep that going. Meanwhile, over here, we got Potty Central, population, your girl, very flirty. Wait, can you flirt and have a salad at once? Cause that'll be ideal. Oh my gosh, you're so close. Don't be sad, you're doing your best. It's hard pottying over and over and over again. No, oh, you're so close. Why are you sad? Oh no, he's gonna cry. Oh no, 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 no. Let's give a bubble bath to Eric. He's not having a good day. Neither of our toddlers are happy. They're both crying and sad alone in their room while mom flirts it up and, ah, oh, okay. Okay, Charlie's only at a B, but Miles and Renee are both A students, which means they can age up in this. And Hazel just reached level three. And Chelsea has a pristine reputation. She is a shining beacon of positivity for the community, passing by other Sims with illicit friendly waves and cheerful smiles. Everybody's day is brightened by her presence. Friends will be more forgiving if she commits a social oh. miscues and they won't be quick to judge her. Finally, Chelsea has earned the credibility to host her very own charity benefit parties. Wow, okay, so we can age up three kids and Chelsea really needs to go. And then one of you can actually bake your own cake, a chocolate cake, because obviously. Why are you still sad? He's scared? Don't be scared. I don't know why you're crying in the club right now. Let's have Miles invite over his dad. And then I think he also knows Mingyu who, he can invite to hang over to. Are they gonna have their own party without Chelsea? Chelsea's gonna sleep through their party. <gasps> Who set the table? Oh my God, that's so cute. Okay, add birthday candles. Oh no, no, no. Oh my goodness. Parenting. Discipline his recent behavior. Ask him not to make a mess. There's someone calling us. Oh my goodness, but his dad's here. Everything's a little crazy right now. Let's hug lovingly. Let's have them like interact with Lars a little bit, take a photo together, have like a nice birthday moment. Chelsea's spotlight is fading, but we just became famous. Tell the baby that he, no, Eric, get back here. <gasps> you are lucky, Miles, that your mom is not around to see what you did because you're cursing. Where's her dad? Oh, Charlie's homework's done. Yeah, Miles aged up. Good job, Miles. He's an adult now. She's taking a photo. They're hanging out with their dad, which is great. Charlie's cleaning up the mess that his little brother Eric made. Eric, go to bed. You are really grumpy. Go to bed. Hazel's dad is here. She's gonna talk with him and hang out. She loves him. Yay! Yeah! Chelsea, get out here. Add some birthday candles for your kids. Help blow out candles for Hazel. Okay, Chelsea. Go do your job. Go get baby Hazel. Oh, Hazel's busy with her dad. Oh, it's so cute. Go get Hazel, help her. Oh. They're playing. Whatever, I'm letting this happen. She can age up in a second. This is too cute. Oh my goodness. 
Oh my goodness. All right, I can't believe that Hazel is already a child. They grow up so fast. Happy birthday, baby Hazel. Oh wow, I just set her down through the table. All right, Hazel aged up. Pick a number between one and four. That would be two. She's a smart girl. Pick a number between one and 30. The answer is three. Three. So she's a goofball. She's a smarty and a goofball. <gasps> wait, I can't wait to see what she looks like. I wanna see her in all of her glory. <gasps> she's cute. Oh my goodness, Hazel. Hazel, hug your father. Oh, he's hugging Chelsea. He's like, congrats. And then we're gonna uh, save. We're moving out the twins. Hopefully making room for even more kids. Oh my goodness. I know that it's technically a one bedroom, but this is also a video game. And in a video game, you can kind of bend the rules of how many people can live in one household. So it's six kids all living together. And then we've got three here. So we're at our nine. Okay, let's go back into the household. Charlie's close to becoming a teen. He's a B student. Yeah, so he'll probably become a teen tomorrow. Our little girl is so grown up and she's sitting with her dad. There's only three kids in the house right now, which is crazy. He's a little hungry. Wait, there's no teens to cook lunch for us. Oh no. We're gonna have to have Chelsea cook. <laughs> oh, you should be going. Bye, see you later, Mingyu. Chelsea's gonna have a baby in... I don't know, so that's exciting. We'll have new kids in the house, new babies. Wow, this really feels like a whole new crop of kids. Like these are all just new kids. There are no OG kids anymore. They're all gone. This is the new, the new kids, the new kids on the block. All right, now her homework's complete so she can go to bed and all the Impeach Schmays are in bed for the evening. Our celebrity level is lost. No, Chelsea. Dang it. Oh, she's in labor. <gasps> Chelsea's in labor. Oh my goodness. Okay, 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 okay. This is not a drill. Have your baby at the hospital. We're gonna join her. Will we make it to 10 kids? I mean, I would hope so, right? Because we just hit nine. It's a girl. She gave birth to a baby girl and this baby girl needs a name. So let's go into the comments once more to figure out what our baby name is. This person suggests Naya for a baby name. I love that baby name. Thank you so much for the suggestion. Naya it is. And thank you for the pronunciation because you know your girl Kelsey can't pronounce things unless you explain them. All right, Naya. Ah, and it's another girl. Oh my gosh, twins. This one says Natalie, which I like two end names for both the girls together. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. That means that we just hit 11 kids on the 100 baby challenge. Three babies in one episode. They're not triplets, but kind of aren't they? Chelsea's gonna go home. We had a very successful episode and we've already started a flirtation ship with the gorgeous Maria, which I think we'll jump into next episode, our 10 baby celebration vacation episode. Feel free to leave some more baby names in the comments below, because that's where I look for my next baby name. We are three new children. I am feeling good. I can't wait for the 10 baby celebration next week. So I'll see you guys next Saturday. So many new babies, so many new babies. Hey guys, it's not Chelsea and Buzzy Multiplayer now has merch. So if you're interested, there's gonna be a link in the description below. I hope you like it because I helped design some of them. Okay, bye.